thank you, Olga, for a very concise and clear ask to uh, our members here. I'd now uh, like to introduce our second lead discussant, Francis Coroma. He uh, represents the youth here, and we are uh, interested to get really, I think, here very concrete proposals on how youth can be embedded into the transition and into the transformation that needs to happen. The floor is yours, please. Hello, everyone. My name is Francis Coma, and I'm the founder and president of Francis Coma Foundation. Um, and today I'm going to deep dive more into um, talking about innovation and SDG 6, how we can try to solve water scarcity. Water scarcity affects like 40% of the world population. And as illustrated, this number is projected to rise. And my foundation and my company, what we try to do is to use the, modern day, the new modern day technology to solve this issue. So what we do is we are using a 3D printing construction machine to build 10,000 liter water tanks in areas where they can get access to safe drinking water, most especially in Africa and in South America. And then also, how can we um, bridge the gap between the stakeholders and the, and the young people? Because the young people, as of this point, they are the, um, the future, and the future is here, and they are the next generation of global leaders. And how can we form their ideas and bring them to the table so they can be part of the solution and the decision making? I feel like that's... Um, one of my interventions that I'm going to more um, focus on, more like um, encouraging the youth and also um, sponsoring the youth and then also see how we can provide resources to them, to their ideas across the world and see how we can bridge the gap between SDG 6 and the SDG goals and then also innovations and technology so we can help, um, we can help achieve this goal before 2030. Thank you. Yeah, thanks a lot, uh, Francis. I think we really need help of, uh, of a lot of different institutional parts and entities to actually ingrain all this discussion also in the younger people because it doesn't help that only when you have finished your studies you realize that there's a problem on this world, but if we want to be honest and truthful about integrating the biggest part of the world population and resolving our issues, then we need uh, uh, more people who get involved. So I think we're at the end of our panel discussion and the lead discussions, and my role for the time being is over. I would like to hand the floor back to our... Uh, Mr. Moderator, and I thank the panelists uh, for the valuable interventions. Now we are... Uh, delegation